what it do with you do today's video on my channel with a quick introduction video in today's video i want to talk about um boxer ryan garcia right yes boxer ryan garcia so this thing going on for like what damn it like close to a week now that he has come out and uh been speaking out against the so-called elite talking about the bohemian grove and um other like allegations and shit that these entities have been doing right now it's funny because um he's not the first boxer to come out and speak about the evil shit he's seen being you know that high up in the industry when i mean in the industry you gotta remember that sports and entertainment that's the same shit you see what i'm saying because sports is a form of entertainment just like music is a form of entertainment sports is too you see what i'm saying so you know it's like like basically it's like this right it's like it's like um the entertainment industry is one building but each side of the building got different wings so on the left wing that's like the sports and shit like yeah they in the same business but they got their own particular field for that particular uh category of entertainment and then on the right wing you have like your music and you know um shit like that and like for example too like um like actors and all that shit that's considered the same thing as entertainment but it's not the same thing as a musician you see what i'm saying so it's basically like being an athlete being a musician being a um being um somebody that's a movie um a movie actor or actress that's all in the entertainment industry but they all got their own different sections if that makes sense you see what i'm saying like yeah they all in the entertainment industry but they all got their own different vip sections so to speak you see what i'm saying so so when uh so when uh ryan garcia came out and said what he said i wasn't i was a little bit shocked but i wasn't too shocked because you had another boxer that came out a couple years ago his name was um see these satanists always laugh at this what's funny shut the fuck up but anyway uh what's the folks name david rodriguez that's his name david rodriguez he had another boxer that came out and was speaking out against oprah and how Oprah, she uh, faced these federal charges and shit. Talk about Hillary Clinton and the shit he's seen in the industry. These are two boxers. Funny that they both Mexican. But um, these are two boxers who have extremely successful careers. Extremely successful. Why would they come out and ruin their career? You see what I'm saying? Like, why would they come out and ruin their career? Like, why? You see what I'm saying? Because they actually seen something. They actually been through something. And it's just funny that I noticed that uh, David Rodriguez and Ryan Garcia, they both boxers, but they both Mexican. And it's nothing wrong with that. But I just noticed that it seemed like, and this is just my assumption, this is just my opinion, it seemed like more black people nowadays are more wicked than a lot of other groups of people. You see what I'm saying? Not every so-called black person and all that type of shit. But I'm just saying, if you, um, if you peep what I'm saying, you see what I'm saying? It seems like, um, that yeah, like more Mexicans nowadays, especially in the industry, like they coming out and speaking about what the fuck going on. They actually telling the truth. A lot of black people saying that they hiding it and, um, and actually running with this evil shit. You see what I'm saying? It's just something I just peep. It's not every black person, but it's the majority of the industry who doing evil shit. It's somebody like a Diddy. And what Diddy is black. You see what I'm saying? But he was fucking with people like Epstein. But Epstein not black. Epstein is white. You see what I'm saying? But I'm just saying, though, like, these people are working together. And for two fucking boxers to come out, and they're not the only people that has come out, but I'm just saying, in recent years, two fucking boxers have come out and said that they've been targeted, their bank accounts have been froze, all this other different shit. Come on, man. So you think these niggas is lying? You think they're just lying? Come on, man. Stop playing, bro. This is real. This is real. Being at the Bohemian Grove and they tied uh, tie Ryan Garcia up, that's real. They 9 out of 10 more likely did that because they want that nigga to cross over or they just want to torment him in different ways because they got different rituals out there. And just because you haven't heard of a certain ritual does not mean it does not exist. So this is going to be part one for right now, man. But wake the damn up. More videos coming soon. Fuck Satan. Fuck all his minions. And you know how we rocking, man. You know how we rocking.
But um, yeah, man. So shout out to Wayne Garcia for actually coming out and uh, speaking that real shit. Shout out to David Rodriguez for coming out speaking that real shit. They know uh, it's end of age, end of glamour. You know what I'm saying? Paradise shift, paradigm shift. Just like for example, like um, like you know how people were saying, like I say like ten years ago or five some years ago, right? Motherfuckers kept on talking about the age of Aquarius. Information age. The age of Aquarius is just another way of saying the golden age or the information age. That's all that is. And that's where we're at right now. We're in the information age. That's where all this information and shit is coming out so frequently. That's why so many people is like, damn, this shit is interesting. This shit more juicier than soap operas because it's the real deal. Wait till damn uh, OVA's coming to on fuck Satan, fuck all those memes, gang. 